Argentina's World Cup win has raised the question, was Pope Francis watching the game? Most likely he didn't, since he said that 30 years ago he made a promise to Our Lady of Mount Carmel to not watch TV, but he still maintained a relationship with soccer legends from his native Argentina, Lionel Messi and Diego Maradona. In 2013, the Pope met with both the Italian and Argentinian national soccer teams. In the Clementine Hall of the Apostolic Palace, he asked the players to remember their humanity, despite their fame. La gente vi segue molto, non solo quando siete in campo, ma anche fuori. Questa è una responsabilità sociale. Mi spiego. Nel gioco, quando siete in campo, si trovano la bellezza, la gratuità e il cameratismo. Se a una partita manca questo, perde forza, anche se la squadra vinca. On that occasion, Messi, along with Italian goalkeeper Luigi Buffon, gave the Pope this small olive tree. He also received a jersey from the Argentinian side. In a press conference following the meeting, the team's captain said this about speaking with the Pope. El encuentro fue cortito, pero muy, muy lindo. Two years later, Pope Francis met with the other great of Argentine soccer, Diego Maradona. He participated in the Pope's education initiative, Scola Socorrentes, and the two discussed child hunger, among other topics. Para que los jugadores... Players must unite and do something for those kids who do not eat in so many parts of the world. We agreed on everything. So all I can say is that I am a fan of Pope Francis. I'm his biggest fan. Although Pope Francis may root for his native Argentina on the inside, he doesn't lose sight of what he said at the start of his pontificate, that there were bigger things in life than soccer. Jesus nos ofrece algo más grande que la Copa del Mundo. Algo más grande que la Copa del Mundo.